What's going on guys, we're back again with the best singer in the entire world. We got Putri Ariani today. Now she she just released a brand new song this morning called Perfect Liar. So she dropped this one yesterday, but it was like this morning because I just woke up to it. And obviously she's in Indonesia. This is her own song guys, this is her own solo song. So this is all made up by herself. You know, she wrote, you know, she wrote, sang and produced everything on this whole track which is unbelievable guys you know she is a singer as well as you know a producer director everything all the stuff that she does it's all her own music so unbelievable this one should be amazing already 60,000 views probably have like millions of views when people more find out about it but this one should be crazy guys make sure to drop a comment down below much love to my Indonesian people thank you so much for the support if you're new to my channel, go back and check out some other reactions. I have a lot of reactions to a wide range of stuff. And yeah, let's get a perfect liar. Let's go. So I like this guy. She's, you know, playing the piano. You know, a lot of her music comes from either the piano or something like that she's normally sitting in front of the piano now she is blind which is incredible that she's able to even play the piano not only you know play it but she's also able to write music for the piano it's kind of ridiculous how amazing and talented she is i'm pretty jealous of her talent but she's blind but she's still able to perform the piano make up her own music but also sing guys so i like to set up piano i knew that there'd be some sort of piano in all the songs going forward in her music so I thought my life was done when we broke up and I I kind of feel desperate when we were separate Without you, without you Connected to my pain, I try to understand Sometimes I'm missing you, but then I hate you So she's kind of going back and forth between lyrics. She's talking about, I hate you, but I felt a void, you know, when you were gone. It's like a relationship type song. Maybe she had a boyfriend or a partner or something, and then they kind of split up and moved apart. You can see, you can hear it in her voice as well, guys. Her voice is so powerful. The way she speaks as she is the greatest singer in the world currently, her voice just like is piercing. The way she's able to like, you know, transition from tone to tone. Yeah, it's unbelievable, guys. I've watched a lot of hours of people talking about how spectacular her music is because of her voice particularly, and it's it's ridiculous. She doesn't have any backup vocals. She doesn't have anything but just her singing. It's incredible. I hate you. Talk to my mirror, think I'm crazy. Okay, this is incredible. So she's basically, like I said, a relationship type song. She's saying, when you said I love you, you're the perfect liar because you made me believe that you actually love me, right? So it's like a, some partner of hers said that she loved her or somebody in her life. And then now they've obviously lied, right? They're the perfect liar because they convinced Putri that they did love them. Don't need to give it. So she's saying, I don't, you don't need to give me anything because I can love myself better. So this is funny, guys. Last year, or I believe it was this year, this year actually, Miley Cyrus dropped a song. And it was basically saying, you know, with Liam Hemsworth, like, I can love myself better. I can buy myself flowers. It was like a woman empowerment type song, guys. And I actually, that blew up. It was one of the biggest songs ever. I quite liked that song. I reacted to it as well, guys. Got a great response. This kind of almost reminds me, not the tone, not the whole vocals, but just the lyrics. The, the lyrics immediately reminded me of that Miley Cyrus song where she talked about, I can love myself better, I can, I can, 
you know, be on, I can buy myself flowers, you know, that song. So, yeah, cool, cool undertones here. Yes, I can love myself better. Mm. Yeah, like, I can buy myself flowers, I can love myself better. It's like, uh, it almost has the same kind of rhyme scheme. It's, that's really cool, actually. Connected to my pain, I try to understand. Sometimes I'm missing you, but then I hate in you. I miss you, I hate you. Talk to my mirror, think <laughs> I'm crazy. So the way she holds the vocals, guys, is spectacular. Like I said, you know, Ronan Keating, all these amazing artists, Irish, American, Canadian, they all said that she was one of the best artists they've ever heard in their life. You know, proper, massive singer. Some of the biggest singers in the world have said that she is the best right now. You know, like I said, Ronan Keating, you know, shout out to Ireland's own Ronan Keating, and he, he did a song with her as well. Like, spectacular. He said that she's one of the best he's ever seen. And you can just tell by her vocals right there, guys. The way she, she's able to hold those notes. Amazing song, amazing song about the loss of love because she says over and over again, you know, I can love myself better. You know, it's it's a like a breakup type song. Amazing guys, her voice is just unbelievable. You know, Putri Ariani, the amount of times that she's had people to collaborate with that they've all said they were amazing vocal coaches. She had Ronan Keating, like I said. <clears throat> She also had David Foster, who's a Canadian, one of the best Canadian singers in the world, on tour with her, Leona Lewis, like all these amazing singers said that she's the best, and she is, guys, you know, she's like the goat of singing right now, so let me know what you all think, much love from Ireland to Indonesia, and like, it's crazy to think that someone so young as well with so many disabilities is able to perform so well, the piano and everything like that, so spectacular, guys, let me know in the comments down below, I love you all, guys, I'll see you all in the next one, man, peace.